so, oh my god, Doctor Who. Oh. Hey guys, welcome back to the show, welcome back to the diary. So yes, I was a bit kind of yeah, with Doctor Who at the minute. Yes, it's a woman, yes, it's amazing and all that sort of thing and it's like oh my god it's Doctor Who yay <laughs> after hearing some people say the Doctor is not right it doesn't feel right because there's not as much energy or anything else in there well fair enough but then again every single actor has brought something new to the Doctor starting with Christopher Eccleston being all moody and just like well lots of planets have a north and all that sort of thing and then David Tennant with, with all his awesomeness. And Matt Smith with his Huda Man. Yeah, no. Never doing that again. It just, every single actor just felt good for the role at their time. And what they brought to it felt natural. It felt right. Even with Peter Capaldi, I do have a problem with a lot of P Peter Capaldi's episodes. Mainly because of the writing, not really because of Peter's actual acting style. I've said before, I've said previously, Peter's an amazing actor. He's not. It's not Peter that's the problem, I don't think. I think it's the writing and everything else around it. But this week's episode of Doctor Who... had me going what how no it can't be I think I know who he is and oh my god Jack's back yes the top point Captain Jack is back in Doctor Who granted it was for this episode at the moment we don't know if he's going to be back. He hinted himself that he's going to be back. John Barrowman said if he gets asked, he will do it the drop of a hat. But the character itself, the character Jack himself, hinted he will be back. Because he said the line, when she needs me the most, I will be there. She will need me and I will be there. So, huh, he's coming back. I don't know when. No one knows when. Will it be in this series? Will it be in this generation regeneration? Will we see the Doctor regenerate one more time before we see Jack again? No one knows. But it was nice to see Jack again on screen as Doctor Who. In Doctor Who, sorry. As... <clears throat> and having John Berman on screen as Captain Jack one more time was amazing because I really do miss Torchwood and I basically at the end of Torchwood when Yanto and, and Tosh died I kind of wanted to, to go in there and slap Jack in the face just like look dude you know what kind of death they would have had if you hadn't recruited them Tosh she would have died by herself in that cell. Yanto. I have no idea what Yanto would have done. He might have got himself into a whole load of trouble and got killed some other way. <laughs> Owen. Owen would have killed himself out of grief and everything else that he held for his wife or his fiance. I can't remember whether they actually got married, but his fiance in general, he would have killed himself, I'm sure of it, because of it. And Jack saved them from those deaths, saved them from the lives they could have had by recruiting them into Torchwood. And yeah, they had an early death, but then again, that's Torchwood. Torchwood has that. It says in one of the series, one of the characters says it in one of the final series. That's quite old for Torchwood in terms of a death death age. 
she lived into, I think it was her 80s or something. Which is, granted, really quite old for Torchwood. Most people, when you are recruited to Torchwood, you don't see 50, you don't see 40, you don't, you barely see 30. Because of the risk and danger of that job, you tend to, tend to die early. <laughs> but because of that series ending in such a way, it was like, no, this, oh, but come on, he can't die, he can carry on, but eh. the pain that Jack suffers, seeing everyone live out their lives and die in front of him, just got the better of him and he couldn't carry on, which is all fair and everything else. But it, it was just a sad moment to see the end of that series and the end of Jack because at that time we thought it was the end of Jack and then he gets the cameo in the Christmas episode not too long after with the um, with the Titanic or no sorry it wasn't the Christmas episode with the Titanic it was when David Tennant was regenerating into Matt Smith, David went around everyone that the Doctor had met and had a strong liking for or a strong connection with and just did something for them. It was amazing to see and it was really, really good. <laughs> so to see Jack back, it was amazing, it was awesome. Hilarious. The first scene, it was like, oh yeah, there's his voice on the radio, on the tannery. Wait a minute. That was American accent. Hang on a minute. I only know one character that puts that emphasis on that letter, or that word. Is that Jack? And then it. He actually speaks properly as Jack and it's like, <gasps> Yeah, that's Jack. Yay! <laughs> and then suddenly he's there and it's like, Oh my days, Doctor, you look amazing. It's just like... <clears throat> Jack, that's, that's, that's not the Doctor. That, no. <laughs> You're going to kick yourself and... Probably do much more than that when you find out exactly who the Doctor is. The moment of, you mean she with the Doctor and Jack like, this I've got to see, it's like, hell's, yeah you got to see it, I want to see your reaction to this. So basically, it was amazing, it was twisty, it was mind-blowing and strange. There were a few holes, but I'm setting those holes back a little bit for a minute. I'm sitting back on those holes because I know Doctor Who and if I know the current writers like I recognised Russell T Davis with his writing style, we will find out later. We will know later. The answers will be given to us later. So I'm not questioning much at the minute. I'm not having a go at any of the choices at the moment because I trust it will be answered and I trust we will know later. So that's it for me today, guys. My question is, did you see it? What do you think? Are you liking it? Are you just as confused as everyone else is? <laughs> I know I am. The Doctor? Her? In... The current Doctor's past? That makes no sense. <laughs> but as I said, I'm not worried about that at the minute. It will be told. So, that's it for me today, guys. Today's question has been given. What do you think? Let me know down below. I will see you tomorrow. See ya. <laughs> Put a little bit of gas